Hello, my friends. How are you? Today, I'm again here with another brand new video. I'm going to play some live trade with the help of candlestick analysis. As you know that I do not use any indicator because indicator will increase the confusion and the indicator indicate you after things happen but we need to know before it happen and the candlestick psychology gave me the idea what is going to happen on next candle though this is not 100% sure but it gave me idea about 90% or more but some of candle gave me even almost 100% surety so the reason i only use candlestick psychology and i'm very much happy with what i am doing today if you want to learn candlestick psychology then you can contact me through the details given on the video description below i have a complete course of educational video where i describe everything elaborately about candlestick psychology you don't need anything apart from the course to be become a profitable trader after mastering candlestick psychology your winning ratio will increase automatically 80 to 90 percent okay so let's start trading according to the market movement we can expect seller's entry here because next possible buyer's entry are here so i'm going to place buyer option here it is not necessary to place trade on every candle place trade only the candle you have enough confidence okay sellers becoming weaker here still have 5 seconds to close our trade okay then this is winning trade let me place another trade okay so between that trade there was some gap and now the otc market has been started this is downtrend market but we have very strong rejection levels from here we have very strong buyers entry but this candle was seller's entry too like this that's the reason we can see another red candle but this candle is showing us the sellers become weaker and candle close almost at the level that's the reason i just place trade with some marginal safety because in this situation sometimes the candle can be small red candle or even small green so the marginal safety will save my trade let's see what happened okay so this is also winning trade okay let me find another opportunity so now if you observe this third we have strong buyers entry levels from here this is a momentum every candle has rejection here here too and the candle become weaker but it's still it's not good to go with the buyers rather than we need to wait for some confirmation and can go with sellers okay i'm going sellers because the momentum is down and still there is some gap to fill it so i placed here lawyer option let's see okay we can see here buyers are more more than sellers 
but I think it will reject because on the left side we have a lot of rejection candle, very strong rejection. So I'm expecting rejection. We have five seconds. Okay, this is lag actually. On the last second, the candle came to my favor and I have on this trade because of my entry point. So let me find another opportunity. Okay, now let me tell you about this chart. We have a bias entry levels. We have a strong rejection, but again the momentum is down. But if you observe the last two candles, these two candles confirming us that buyers are going to enter our next candle. But the problem is this phase. So in this situation, we need to wait for some good confirmation and proper marginal safety. If we have this candle up to this level, then we can go with the buyers. Otherwise, it's uh, better to avoid this trade. But I would not suggest to go with sellers in this situation because this candle has buyers entry too. So let me wait for some time and proper plus yes. I have the candle exactly where I was expected. So I placed here higher option. This is the right place to trade here. But I'm expecting it will reject again because of the left side has rejection, very strong rejection and it's a level. We have 15 seconds. Buyers are trying to enter. Okay, again at the last second, I have owned this trade and this is OTC market, so anything can happen at any time. So try to understand before you place any trade. Let me find another opportunity here. Okay, now let me observe this candle. We have 20 seconds. Yes. See what happening here. There is no sellers. You can see buyer's entry from this level. Okay. So now I think I should choose to go with buyers because we have very strong buyer's entry. Market is moving something like this. Okay. Then came little down. Again, made little half here, you can see. And candle came to this level. We have seen something happen here. So I think it's good to go with the buyers, but not from here, because due to this seller's pressure, there can be small candle. Uh, mostly, this candle will make something like this. Due to this sellers, there will be seller's entry and then candle will close above to the rejection level. So I will wait if I have the candle here little lower than this level then I will go with buyers otherwise I will skip this trade. Okay. So let me wait. At least the candle should come here. Yes, it came here. Now I can place my trade. Okay, and I'm expecting this candle will be a green candle. If you observe last four candle, that last four candle confirm us 
there should be a buyers but sometimes there can be small green candle okay very strong buyers entry okay should be green because of the candle psychology now again look at the candle last four red candle it will confirms you that the buyers are going to enter on next candle now tell me what about the chart we have market movement something like this sellers buyers again sellers there is no new low we have buyers but no new high rather than we can see gradually the candle getting rejection lower than this previous candle did you observe here so here we have a breakout and we know what we should do if we have single candle breakout then again we can see sellers tried but failed again tried failed so buyers are here at least from here we have seller entry market is moving quite down trend so what we should do after this two rejection from lawyer side we should not go with buyers we should try to place lawyer option but with proper confirmation let's see if we have good price yes this is the perfect time i think yes so i have placed here lawyer option and i am expecting this candle is going to close at the previous candle rejection level this is the level candle will close here so let's see okay and this is not necessary to place trade on every candle place trade only when you have enough confidence otherwise do not place your trade so thank you so much for watching this video please leave a feedback how do you feel about this video and share the video with your friends thanks a lot take care